question, bakit po weights ang pinakamagandang exercise sa lahat ng mga options dyan? Bakit hindi na lang po ako magpapawis o kaya yung mga, alam niyo yung mga circuit cardio workouts like running, jogging, sprinting, cycling or biking, swimming. Bakit hindi na lang ganun? Bakit hindi na lang mga boxing exercises or may involved na, na, ano, na home workouts like body weight workouts or sunod-sunod na exercises na na nakakapawis like crossfit okay like circuit training bakit hindi na lang yon bakit bakit kailangan weights bakit sobrang nirerecommend mo ang weight training oh, i'm going to die i'm so tired everything hurts running is impossible only one reason okay one reason muscle mass Okay, tatandaan niyo to, muscle mass. Okay, importante sa health na ma-maintain mo yung normal level to above level. Okay? Average to above average of muscle development. Okay, bakit? Guys, tatandaan niyo, isa sa mga primary function ng katawan natin, isa sa mga primary systems ng katawan natin is the nervous system. Okay, pag yan ang bumigay, okay, bigay lahat. Okay? And one part of the nervous system is the muscular system. Kinokontrol din niya ng nervous system. Okay? Hindi lang to for look sake or for vanity sake. Alam ko maganda tignan yung tone ka, may muscle ka, maganda yung shape mo. Okay? This is this is not what I'm talking about. Okay? I'm also talking about the health part. Okay? The more muscle you have, okay, study shows the the healthier you are. Okay? Kung ayaw mo niwala, punta ka sa sa ano natin sa mga researches sa sa website natin versus youfitness.com okay makikita mo doon yung mga researches about weight training okay ang reason kasi diyan your muscles decay or your muscles atrophy ibig sabihin you lose muscle every year after umedad ka ng 25 okay law of thermodynamics yan the second law of thermodynamics is the law of going down or ano yung main term doon entropy buti na lang meron akong google dito <laughs> atrophy na sa isip ko eh. so parang magkaparehas pala siya entropy the law of entropy lahat ng mga bagay sa mundo ngayon pababa pabulok pa ano pa pasira okay so yan yung ano yan yung isang reason okay pag pag mababa ang muscle mass mo pansin mo lahat ng may sakit kumpara mo sa mga walang sakit okay Palaging ano, palagi ka may may kitang pattern, they have less muscle. Okay, pag nagkasakit ka, automatic ang nawawala agad sa iyo muscle tapos naiiwan yung body fat which is nakakainis. Okay, yung pinaka worst kasi body fat is a stored energy source na ano lang yan, ginagamit mo lang for energy madalas. Mas metabolically active or mas mabilis mong na-burn palagi is muscle mass. Okay? Ang rule dito, what you don't use, you lose. Does anybody else have a question? Um, I have, uh, I have a question. I think some of the people here might be sexually inexperienced. Is it true that if you don't use it, you lose it? Is that a serious question? No, it wasn't. Okay. Okay. Pag hindi mo ginagamit yung muscle mass mo, okay. Pag hindi siya challenged, pag hindi siya tatandaan yun to lage. Muscle mass, if you want to maintain it, okay. Ang binabasa lang niya force. Okay? Ano bang amount of force yung binibigay mo sa muscles mo? Okay? And I don't know any simpler way to do that sa weights. Okay? Magdagdag ka lang ng 5 pounds, alam mong mas malakas ka compared sa dati. Okay? Kumpara mo sa mga, sa mga sinabi ko kanina. Okay? Let's take for example, crossfit. Halimbawa, ayaw mo talaga sa weights. Okay? Talagang hindi ka, ano, hindi ka fan ng weights, which is dumb actually ano pwede mong gawin ang kailangan mong gawin kung kung hindi ka fan ng weights is kasi ang pinaka effective way para ma-maintain mo yung muscle mass na meron ka ngayon or mag-gain ka ng muscle i suggest dahil nga pababa okay na yung trend ng 
ng ano mo, ng pag-edad mo ng 25 pataas, okay, I'm 24, malapit na ako, okay, dahil nga pababa yung trend, dapat ang lagi mong program is for you to build muscle, okay, and what better way to do that, gain strength, okay, progressive overload. Eh, kung ngayon mo lang narinig to, pero matagal ng concept to, Okay, the best way to maintain and gain muscle is by progression. Okay, overload. Kailangan dumalakas ka. Okay, tension. Progressive tension overload. Kung gusto mong mag-build ng muscles around your your ano, your arm, dapat malakas ka sa pulling movements. Okay? Kasi heavily activated 'yan ng forearms and yung bicep mo. Okay? So ganun lang sa kasimple. Okay, ngayon pinaka simple siya sa weights. Sabi ko nga magdagdag ka lang ng weights, alam mo na. Okay, sa CrossFit, ang ang ang, ang mahirapan ka sa progression, okay? Doon sa mga sinabi ko kanina, boxing, CrossFit, running, uh, kung ano-anong mga circuit plyometric cardio. Pag nag-CrossFit ka, ang problema mo is yung yung Olympic weight lifting movements, medyo komplikado siya. Tapos yung rest period sobrang ikli napagod ka pa, papasok ka na agad sa set, ano ka pa so, kaya marami akong kilala na i-injure, okay, lalo na pagka, pagka they do challenging weights, kasi nga pagod ka pa in the set then papasok ka na agad gagawin mo na agad yung set, so pag injured ka palagi, pag palagi kang may aches and pains ano mangyayari sa'yo, hindi ka magpo-progress hindi ka lalakas, okay, mahirap lumakas sa mga okay, sa sa mga Uh, apart from lifting weights okay uh, lifting weights properly okay i'm not saying okay wag ka mag crossfit pero kailangan merong kang progression okay ay mapapansin mo lahat ng mga uh, explain natin dito is all about how can you progress okay so kung sa ano ka naman sa home workouts okay body weight workouts mar maraming babae ganyan lalo na yung mga mga moms, okay, ba mom of three ka, mom of two ka na medyo maliliit pa, wala kang time, pumunta sa gym, okay, the, make sure, okay, make sure you are doing your body weight workouts properly, may progression na nangyayari, okay, kung 15 reps pa din ang squats mo, okay, do pistol squats, okay, what are you doing, kailangan merong challenge, kasi pagka, use ta, kapag ka, Sanay na yung muscle mass mo sa ginagawa mo, you will lose it. Okay? Dapat ginagamit mo siya progressively. Okay? Dapat may challenge. Dapat merong ano. Alam mo yun? Kaya nga, ang, ang suggestion ko sa mga moms na, or sa mga kaya lang mag-home workout, hindi lang naman moms, mga may busy sa trabaho, buy resistance bands. Okay? Bumili ka nun kasi you will, ano, you will put weight on your ano on your on your movements or buy dumbbells or buy some set of barbells okay yun nga lang limitado yung equipment mo boxing okay let's talk about boxing paano ka naman magpo-progress in terms of ano doing the the jabs okay sa boxing ang ang marami kang pwedeng gawing strength progression diyan pero komplikado pa rin okay dapat chine-check mo kung lumalakas ka ba sa suntok mo? Okay? Or time frame, time period kung dati itong speed bag na gagawa mo ng 30 seconds, ngayon kaya mo na gawin ng 45 seconds. Okay? Parang sa home workouts din, build resistance, okay? In fact, kahit nga mga boxers na go weights. So, sa side no. So, ano pang pwede mong gawin? Longer time. Yun nga lang yung ano niya, disadvantage niya kung kung dati 1 hour, kahit pwede na, ngayon kailangan mo 2 hours, kailangan mo 3 hours. Okay, yun ang problema sa mga papawis workout, sa mga, sa mga ano mo yun, cardio type workouts. Ano yun, titira ka na sa gym, okay, pag nasanay na yung katawan mo. So, ano yan, uh, at the same time, kung hindi ayos ang nutrition mo, you can metabolize your muscle mass by doing <laughs> excessive amounts of cardio. Okay? So, pag boxing, make sure lumalakas ka sa suntok mo, whether sa time mo, or sa sa speed, or sa uh, footwork. Okay? Make sure. Kasi kahit naman mga boxers, magaganda pa rin yung katawan. Eh. So, okay? Ganun lang siya kasimple. 
Doon naman sa ano sa mga common type cardio training, ano yan, mga running, jogging, sprinting. Okay, I wouldn't recommend long distances. Okay? Especially sa biking. Kasi you unless you're a marathon runner, pwede rin, pero ayusin mo yung nutrition mo. Okay? I don't recommend ano long distances. I recommend short and intense uh, burst of ano intensity. Okay, tatandaan nyo, muscle, ang kaibigan ng muscle intensity. Okay, pag intense yung ginagawa mo, you you ano, you tear your muscle fibers, you force it to grow, you force it to improve. Okay? So kailangan lagyan mo ng intensity. For example, sa sa jogging, huwag ka lang mag-jogging ng jogging lang. Okay? Lagyan mo ng interval, lagyan mo ng For example, 10 seconds ano, uh, running, tapos 30 second jog, tapos paulit-ulitin mo yun for 30 minutes. May challenge. Okay? Ngayon, wala akong problema sa sprinting kasi sprinting is one way of using intensity. Okay? So, very good ang, 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 ano, ang, sprint, ang sprinting para sa akin. Okay? Kaya maraming sprinters, kung titignan mo yung picture ng sprinter at saka marathon runner, ibang-iba. Mas maganda tignan yung sprinter, mas toned, mas muscular mas ano by the way sprinters use weights also to improve their performance okay swimming okay swimming is a good way of exercising okay pero mas superior pa rin ang weights again swimming kaya lang pag nagsuswimming ka kailangan dire-diretso kailangan ang bibilangin mo diyan yung laps mo and yung time mo kailangan nag-i-improve yan each and every session Chalmers from Australia up there in lane number three. That's the team I think that really has got a great shot of winning this. He was 47 flat earlier in the preliminaries, but he is way back. What a big turn! What a big turn! What a big turn by Michael Phelps! Michael Phelps rockets out ahead of Bobby and Gilo and Prince who have the lead, but Phelps now. I hope na kuha mo yung point ng video na to. Okay? Pinaka simple ang weights. Okay? Pinaka sustainable ang pag weights. Okay? Malalaman mong lumakas ka dahil dadagdagan yung weight mo, dadagdagan yung reps na ginawa mo. Okay? For example, you're doing 200 pounds for 5 reps and then you do 200 pounds for 7 reps or 205 pounds for 6 reps. Alam mo nag-improve ka na agad. Okay? Alam mong na-maintain mo or nag-gain ka ng muscle by doing weights. At the same time, hindi siya ganun kahaba. Okay, pag nag-weights ka, you only spend like, what, 20 to 30 minutes, 45 minutes at most, tapos ka na. Okay, the actual workout, kasama rest. Compared mo kapag ka nagkaroon ka ng mga papawis workouts, ilang, nag-zumba ka for example, like 2 hours ka nag-zumba, okay, nag-lose ka pa ng ano, nag-lose ka pa ng ano doon, ng muscle doon by doing a lot of it. Okay, so... Yun lang yung point ng video na to, okay? You have to do resistance overload training, okay? Kailangan palaging merong challenge, okay? Kailangan palaging may overload. In fact, weights are so effective na kahit nga mga nasa ibang sport like wrestling, boxing, nabanggit ko na kanina, swimming, kahit yung mga, ano, mga gymnasts, gumagamit sila ng weights, basketball players, football players, hockey players, gumagamit sila ng some sort of barbell movements or dumbbell movements. Okay? Ganun siya nagta-translate in terms of brute strength. Kasi, ano yun? Uh, the, the more muscle you have, the, ano, the, the directly proportional siya sa force na kaya mong i-produce. Okay? Even martial artist gumagamit ng weights. Bruce Lee, okay, uses weights to, ano, to improve his performance to improve his power. So, yun yun. Yun yung, ano, yun yung reason bakit weights. It's simply just effective on maintaining muscle mass. Isa pa. Isa pang sinasabi nila heart health daw. What about heart health? Kung mag-weights ka lang, hindi lalakas ang heart mo. Okay? Palagi kong sinasabi sa kanila, tingnan mo ha, kung develop ang katawan mo, kung heart natin ang pinaka, ano, pinaka, center or heart natin ang reason bakit uh, may circulation yung blood natin siya yung nagpapump ng dugo tingin mo pag develop yung katawan mo hindi malakas ang heart mo okay pag malak pag meron kang solid muscle base hindi rin magdi-develop yung heart mo at di ba ang ang heart is a form of muscle kaya nga may cardiac muscle 
Okay? Kasi muscle din yan eh. Okay, it pumps blood. In fact, nung nagpa-check ako sa St. Luke's, nagpa-transfer ako ng dugo, hindi ako pinayagan kasi daw low blood ako. Okay, not because I'm healthy ako, but because yung heart ko nag-develop siya ng muscle na kahit konti lang yung pump niya, nagsisirculate na yung dugo all over. Okay, kaya pagka tinignan mo sa reading dun sa pulse ng ng ano ng ng ano nila ng meter nila low blood which is by ano by policy okay by policy hindi ka pwedeng magpa donate ng low blood okay plus i do intermittent fasting so naka, naka ano rin yun naka ano rin yun sa pag low blood yun nag-alala ako sabi ko ala bakit po ganun low blood doc sabi lang ng doctor sa akin wag kang mag-alala ganyan talaga pagka nag-weights kapag ka physically active kapag ka malakas ang heart mo, okay? Low blood ka talaga kalimitan, okay? So, hindi yan ano, hindi yan delikado, hindi yan unhealthy. Ano lang talaga siya? May extra muscle lang yung heart mo, okay? So, that's the video for today. I hope you like this and I hope mag-weights ka na. Tag mo yung kaibigan mong kumari mo, kalimitan babae, na takot mag-weights, okay? Send mo sa kanya yung video na to and... Yeah, I hope na, na, na inspire kayo kung nag weights ka na. Do that for life. Okay, don't just do it, ano, do it uh, safely. Okay, don't be stupid. Okay, don't, don't be, uh, yes, weights pala. Okay, kaya mag, magiging careless ka na. Okay, be careful pa din. Kasi it is still, ano, it is still challenging to do. Okay, so I hope you like this video. And if you like this, comment below kung may tanong ka pa. And we'll answer that. I'm happy to answer that. Okay? So, bye-bye. Peace.